Hello valued viewers, I hope you're all doing very well. Today for something a little bit different, we've got our friend George on. Hello George. Hello, today we're just going to concentrate on an oversimplified version of an otherwise complicated aerial invasion of an airfield. Roger, where do you want to start? We're going to start with a few very oversimplified assumptions. So first, arguably, the worst place to dogfight is while you're flying in an enemy SAM coverage area. It's difficult to dogfight while you're dodging enemy SAMs. Secondly, the best place to dogfight is while you're in friendly SAM coverage because now the enemy's got to dodge the SAM missiles. The area in between where there's no enemy SAM fire, neither friendly nor enemy, I would argue don't fight there either. Make the enemy come to your SAM coverage. So with that general doctrine in mind, this is how a proper invasion works. Once again, highly oversimplified. We have two types of air defense. We have the high to medium air defense, we call that HIMAD, and we have the short range air defense, we call SHORED. Now HIMAD has very long ranges, but in most cases, aircraft can simply fly under the coverage. And then the SHORED protects against low flying aircraft in a complementary fashion to the HIMAD. So back to our dogfighting theorem. Since we're invading, it's difficult to lure the enemy into our, our SAM network. They can defend without leaving their own airspace. So what we do instead is take SAM assets to them. Quite simply, we load Shurad into cargo aircraft and deploy a SAM corridor into their enemy base. Once we're close enough, we unload our combat vehicles on runway and destroy anything that's left. So I'm going to show you this, this automated version of, of what we're going to do, and then we'll try to accomplish all this and it's going to go in five parts. Part one, we have all these MORS launchers with small diameter bombs that we're going to launch at the enemy. We have some F-22s and F-15Es that we're going to launch towards the base. We have some C-130s carrying Rolands, Avengers, and ammo trucks that we're going to deploy along as our, our SAM corridor. And then we'll have a C-5 fly into the base and, and drop off tanks and Gepherds and Rolands. The MLRS will suppress the enemy defenses fighters will conduct combat air patrol. The C-130s will deploy along the SAM corridor, and we're calling these checkpoints Oompa, Loompa, Doobity D, and finally Willy Wonka. And then the C-5 is going to deploy an invasion force at the Chocolate Factory, which is our last checkpoint and our, our overall objective. Um, as you zoom back, what you'll see is that we have um, HIMAD ranges that overlap each other. So our HIMAD uh, Patriot system goes all the way into the enemy base and vice versa. Their S S10 system goes all the way to us. So initially we'll want to start um, pretty low if, we, if we're flying this. And what you'll see is, you know, aircraft from both sides going at each other. And in this case, I just started with them all in the air because we didn't need all the, the other things for the brief. It, it'll be about 30 seconds in where you'll see all the, uh, um, the glide bombs starting to launch towards the base. And we're going to be using um, the MLRS systems to suppress pretty much everything on the ground. Once we get there, we have to take over the base, but we need to first establish or suppress all the, uh, the enemy SAMs and then destroy what we can on the ground. And what you'll see as, as, the, uh, as these uh, glide bombs get close, the SA-10s are gonna start intercepting the, the glide bombs because they have anti-ballistic capabilities. And it's about here if you're on the F-10 map, but keep watching this, this is kind of fun. But you'll see that the, um, everybody's going to start dogfighting. But the SAM systems are still so tied up with the glide bombs that they can't really target the aircraft at this point. The enemies are flying F-14Bs and J-11s just because it, it seems appropriate for an enemy force. Now, if, you, if you're on the ground now because the uh, enemies will be respawning, you'll be able to see... Oh, I guess they're not respawning yet, but if, if, you're, if you're close to the enemy base, what you'll be able to see is this bombardment of, of just everything there. There's explosions just happening all over the base because they've managed to get through and even though they're still fighting back with their anti-ballistic systems it's just being overwhelmed with this, this rocket strike
as you come back to F10, you'll see that they're just about out of targets there. And the enemy had um, what, a ZSU-23 is for short-range stuff. They have uh, Tungustas, Tors, um, the SA-10 system, and they had a company of tanks, which is 10 tanks. And you see the second wave of, of uh, enemy aircraft coming out, because just like you'd have in any DCS public server, they're going to keep respawning at you while we're doing this. Oompa, of course, has just deployed his first set of, uh, of SAM missiles via uh, Hercules aircraft, and they're establishing a SAM corridor along this axis. And in game, we'd have to actually drop them in. I couldn't figure out how to do that automatically, but it would take about the same amount of time. And in the back of all these cargo aircraft, the C-5 moves a lot faster than her. Do they actually drop them out the back uh, on parachutes, uh, or do they land? In a C-130, you just land and drop them out the back. Watch out, the next one's in. Right, Loompa. And you see uh, Dupity D's just about to deploy. Whoa. Uh -oh. Now our Patriot missile launcher way back at Golden Ticket is still firing at enemy aircraft because they're up high enough to do that. As it is, at this point, all the enemy air defenses have been suppressed, so we have freedom of altitude, but they still have fighters spawning at us trying to keep us from taking over. So George, would there be um, ground troops deployed for where the Hercules are going to drop these uh, shore ads off to... The, the ground troops are going to be on the C-5, and they're going to land on the base. And in between, the only ground troops are going to be uh, the Shred units, which you just saw that the, the last one was, uh, um, I think that was Willy Wonka, right? I tried to get it so that uh, on this automatic version, the C-5 would actually land on the base and do this, but it, I, I was having trouble getting the simulation to do that, so at this point, it's just sort of an automatic thing just flies over and then they just appear there. But as we do this as a manual way, um, if I was flying a C-5 and I was planning on being the one flying a C-5, I'd actually have to land the thing at the base. The next, the um, equipment. The next shore ads are in, George. Right, and, and what you'll see, they're actually shooting at them. So, you know, here we got dogfighters trying to fight, fight each other, plus they're trying to fight um, Sam, and it's, it's very difficult for them to fly around. And once the C-5 gets in close enough, you'll just see the the, uh, the ground troops appear, which they have. It's a little unrealistic that they would just pop out and appear, but what happens, say, they dropped up a couple of Rowans, and you're saying they're just cleaning out all the ciliary equipment, plus anybody that spawns on the ground is going to get shot up by a couple of Rowans. There's a tank down there. That's that's all it takes. Now, this, this simulation takes... Six minutes and 35 seconds. And if you're doing it in real life, well, you got to add about another minute because you got to take off. There's a lot of planning involved in doing all this, but the actual execution of, of something of this scale is still going to take less than 10 minutes. And that's a real thing. Now, when you zoom back a little bit, what you see here, what we've established is this SAM corridor, mm -hmm. right? If the enemy were to come back and try to, to take it again, we still have this very secure corridor that we could run cargo aircraft and resupply this base. So it'd be very difficult for them to take it back. That's how you do it. You establish the SAM corridor, you put, your, um, put in your aircraft, you do your invasion, and then it's secure. You suppress the enemy defenses, create the SAM corridor, fight through the corridor and drop off your troops. It's an otherwise simple kind of plan, 
but it's very effective. Right. Um, what's the next step? Do we kind of run it again, but as human players to see it, to see it from the cockpit point of view? Is I'd, that I'd like next? to. I had this plan for everybody actually flying something, so yeah, I, don't do know, I don't know if we have quite enough pilots for this. I, I don't know how much we can run automated. It'd take a second to... We'll go and figure it out, viewers. It. We'll be back uh, in a few seconds for you guys. Right, uh, we've just been talking to George. We're now going to do a manual version with Grim Reapers god help us flying the aircraft so it's going to be the same idea as what we did before blue pilots are going to be myself and drop in hercules starting in the blue base we're going to take off we're going to fly to we can't because we've only got two hercs we can't do all of these we're going to fly to lumper here we're going to try and land we're going to offload the sam systems then we're going to take off we're going to fly to willy wonka we're going to try and offload at willy wonka and then that's the hercs done isn't it george that's it. If if you didn't get through, pick up another C-130 and try it again. Roger. Blues are also going to have uh, air defense in terms of F-15s and Raptors. That's going to be Simba, Bird, and Squirrel. They're going to try and defend us. Then we've got Baddies, who's going to be respawning Cannonball in J-11 slash Tomcat. And um, I guess we're going to see how it goes. And George, you're flying the Galaxy, apparently. Is that right? I am. There is a mod out there. It's very old. It doesn't work very well, but it does work. Welcome in, viewers. Uh, when George turned up for this, I had absolutely no idea what was going on. And to be honest, I didn't think it was going to work. But blow me down. I think everything's just about working. So what we've got here is myself in a fully flyable Herc, which is amazing. Um, I've got drop behind me somewhere in another one on the blue base. Simba and Squirrel in Raptors and everything appears to be working. I've got Bird in an F-15EX. Uh, his missiles are showing as bombs for me, which is weird. But apparently everything's working, which is good. And no joke, we've got George in a fully flyable C5 Galaxy, which I didn't even know existed, which is amazing. And we're going to try and do what we saw before and everything has to be done properly after land and do my ramp hydraulics and all that stuff and we've got a cannonball on a red base so we've got f10 map here it's set to data link only so we see what our data link sensors see i'm pausing now good luck everyone and create a black hole no no black hole right do you want to do your hydraulics now um do your pump i haven't used herc in ages viewers and i forgot how cool it is look i physically got these tanks and stuff in here not just made up they're in here and i'm gonna to to physically offload them it's like the coolest freaking thing ever who's taking off is that simple wimber uh, squirrel come on squirrel do a thing oh the spds are firing or whatever they're called the uh small damage bombs that's kind of cool right all in all that's right i'm quite enjoying this george and i didn't even have to do any work george did it for me george you can do this again I've decided. I'll see what I can do. You going up, Simba? Oh, apparently not. Oh, he's rearming. Um, just to uh, squirrels taking A120Ds, they're Grinelli's, and when we haven't tested them, we're not sure if they work, so to be safe, Simba's going to rearm with poor game one A120Cs that we've got everything covered. Look at George and his giant frigging galaxy! We've never had a flying galaxy in game so far, viewers. Anyone remember how to fly a um, Herc? Oh, apparently I'm doing it. No. No. What vector is it drop? No. No. Oh my god, I'm around to about 150. No. No. It's in my control is issues, no. viewers. I haven't flown this in a long time. Oh my god. Yeah, I 100% almost stalled into uh, a hangar there. Don't worry, viewers, we will cut that out of the video. And George is airborne in his giant C5! George, you've got the biggest balls in the world out of anyone I've ever met. Simba's rolling. Watch your Simba. You can just burn ahead of us. We'll be going like 100 knots, so don't worry about it. Oh, oh god, the boys are fighting already. Right, I'm going to try and watch. Let's have a quick look at our glide bombs going in. Smash that evil Iranian slash... What, is this supposed to be a certain country? George, or...? Uh, I was going to say it was Iranian because the F-14s. There you go. Iranian viewers. Cannibal's gone off data link, FYI, so it's hidden somewhere. Have a look at Bird and his giant... Look at that. Look at that for a loadout, viewers. 25 attackums. On his F-15. Bit weird, but... It's Bird. Now, where's giant bulls George? There he is. What have you got in that thing, George? I've forgotten. Uh, there's a tank. 
two Keppards, and a Roland. Can a C5 carry tanks in real life? It can carry two. Wow. Of course, they're like 60 tons, aren't they? Uh, 60, 70, depending on how it's loaded. There we go. Well, that man said, I guess. I've got to drop all down low and professional. Not me. Not me, viewers. Call out your missiles, guys, so I've got something to watch. It's called Fox It gives your uh, position away, but the viewers are at the heart of this at the end of the day. Yep. Aim 120 Ds are working. Cannonball. <gasps> cannonball for Simba. Oh, just stood right past him. I think Cannonball might be a little bit busy, Simba. Oh, he's hit. Well done, Squirrel. He can respawn, though. Absolutely. It was designed to be respawned. Are the blues respawning today, George? Yes. Um, it, it might take a little bit longer, but, um, you know, if this goes flawless, this, this mission takes six minutes. Nothing in 35 ever, seconds. Nothing ever goes flawless in a GR uh, break, George. It's not possible. Uh, I'm not sure about these uh, Amman Deltas. Uh, I'm down to one Fox 2. That was a Fox 2 kill. We saw fit to give Simba A120 Charlies. Ooh, Simba! Simba's doing a thing. He's 100% doing a thing. He's taking out the red eyes, viewers. You naughty, naughty Simba. It's legal. Oh, jeez. Bird's in with his attacker oh, missiles. To be fair, I was going to ask if you wanted me to be gentlemanly, but I took his silence as a snub. There we go. Oh, he did, didn't he? He didn't, he didn't answer you. That's a him problem. He's got bigger problems than that right now, Simba. Oh, he's crashed! Unfortunately, I got set up where I have to taxi before I can take off, so I don't get to just roll right down the runway. There's a thing, guys. Right, I am on my way to break L Lumpa. I'm on my way to Lumpa, guys. I'm going to set my S up. I get the feeling we need to give Red another player. Someone want to jump over to you Red? To... You want me to swap over? I do, Simba. Go and give Cannibal some help. Copy that. George, you turned around. You've got chicken. I, I did. I wanted to make sure that you um, you deployed... Uh, your SAM assets. George being sensible. Get the corridor down before I get in there. You'll never be a Grim Reaper. Right, Cap is 10 miles from Lumpa. And I need coverage. Drop, I would turn around if I were you. He can probably see you on data link. Just saying. I'll, I'll dogfight him. It's fine. Um, Ladies and gentlemen, draw a bird. I'm I not mean, saying you're being useless, but can you do better? <laughs> I <laughs> mean, I'm, I'm, I just did a show of force to the, the flanker that's about to take off. <laughs> Thanks for that, bird. That really helps. If you're worried about uh, a fighter getting you just uh, land, drop your equipment off, get a new uh, bird because it doesn't do any good if you get shut down. Yeah, it doesn't. Bad drop. Bad, bad drop. Right, squirrel. Make that Absolutely. flanker die. Cap, it looks like uh, they're coming around. after you. Yeah, you may have around. to just no. You may just have to drop where where you're at if I'll you drop. can. Don't worry, I'm a trained fighter. That helps. It, it, we, we just need to establish a corridor. <sighs> the attackers are not guiding. The damn attackers are not guiding. Get off, knobhead. Cannonball splash. Oh, yes! I'm going to have to RTB, I'm afraid. Uh, Watch her, do it. Interesting. We're okay, George. Respond. Yep, just do it. What yeah, happened to drop? See if, you, uh, see if you can drop uh, first the corridor. I'm doing at, it. Uh, not Oompa, but Loompa. Roger. Um, oh, it looks like you're down. No, 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 no. I'm good. I'm flying. I may be off the map. Flash, one F-15. Well, if, if you're destroyed off the map, what it, that means uh, you won't be able to uh, uh, drop your equipment. You're a knob, Cannonball. Yeah, you're yeah. going to have to respawn. All right, this is going to be hard when we fought for viewers. Punching it. All right, let's go, 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 go. Well, they know the plan, so we're going to have to uh, back up a little bit on, on the border. Yes, we're gonna have we to are. start at Oompa. All right, Bird, you need to switch to um, your attackums are not guiding. You need to switch to Raptor. Done it already. Ladies and gentlemen, bird. Learning. It's a learning computer. For our viewers, the corridor is going to be harder than we thought. Yeah, drop can deploy them. Roger. Uh, does anyone know if the M120Ds worked or not, or whether you've got to rearm? I haven't established that yet. No. I've just come up with 120s no. again, uh, Ds no. again, so I'll let you know in a minute. Roger. I'll, I'll let you know in about five minutes. Roger, bird. Don't call me Shirley. But I like it. Right, we've got Simba being a... Uh-oh, Simba's going for George. George, run! George, like your afterburners. That's an hors d'oeuvre. Simba is... Why isn't our friggin' Patriot working today?
Uh, he's probably down low. Patriot is 100% up and working. This car was out. Yeah, I'm seeing the A120Ds wiggle their nose, Squirrel, which means they should be working. Huh. What the hell is an AMRAP ER? Is that what I'm firing now? Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, what the hell is an, what's an AMRAP ER? But you suck. You, that sucks at life, and I don't know why what, you're sucking What have life. I done? You've restored a bodrog. Have you kept the weapons pack in, by the way, Bird? Uh, you twat! I mean, don't get me wrong, firing attackums and Amram ERs is impressive. I'm impressed by you, but those missiles ain't gonna track. Come on, Squirrel. I need a bit of killing, and I need it now. I'll try to load something more vanilla next time. Roger, try and uh, check your SA Squirrel. Guy's got, uh, got through to the AWACS, and he must be destroyed. Bird, you too. Turn cold, Use George. My face. Baddy Waddy coming. You should have guns still. You may even have sidewinders. Look at George, friggin' man, handle that thing! Look at it go, viewers! Friggin' super, uh, what is it? Uh, galaxy. Friggin' die, he's just gone off data link. He's back on data link. An Amram ER out, viewers! Right up his tailpipe, guide! No, it doesn't work! Oh! Yes, it tracked! Did it work? It yes! Got me, it got me. Amram ER works! What is an Amram ER, guys? I still don't even know. It's a thing, viewers. I think I didn't know existed. Right, we're doing all right. That was, who was that Simba down? Uh, cannonball. Right, there's a chance for the corridor. George, there's a chance for the corridor. Punch it. Right, I? and you know, the the corridor locations, they're suggested. If you're under attack, just make sure you can oh. get your, your Hercules down and put it down wherever you got it. I was unaware of that. I should have briefed it, so. That's all right. That's why pencils have erasers, George. All right, let's go. <laughs> What's a pencil? I haven't seen a pencil in a minute. Wait, let me remember what that is. Pencil best sill is what it is. Best writing implement. Are you watching, DJ? Or are you touching yourself? Yes, I'm watching. So, and, I'm, I'm doing and both. touching yourself? I'm multitasking, yeah. Right. DJ's joined in, viewers. And DJ, as you all know, is best J. Now, at this point, we don't really have an altitude restriction because they don't have any SAMs left. Uh-oh. Check that SA squirrel. Use that data link. Oh, the Amram ER, the magic Amram ER that we have no idea how we got is going to do a thing. Did it hit Simba? Ah, oh, lucky son of a bee. But the C-130 should probably fly lower just in case you need to land on the uh, spot. I can't because I'm, uh, I'm in town watching. I'll be all right. I trust my boys. Squirrel dogfighter. Squirrel turning cold. Is it a two-in-one? Is it a two-in-one? It is! You got the other guy! Look at Squirrel learning the skills. Bird going in with his Amram ERs. Yeah, Squirrel Winchester again. Been having to rely on Fox 2s. Uh, I don't think the abilities are up to much. Roger. Right, we're coming up... try the Amram ERs then. Coming up to Charlie checkpoint. Right? They kind of move, don't they? They really move, Bird. I don't know what's going on here. It's better than attack -ems. You know what? attack -em didn't work. Amram ER. Works. George is doing his thing. George is still alive. He hasn't died yet. Man, I'm gonna fly galaxies for all air-to-air -air missions now. Uh-oh. 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 One missed. One hit. Oh! Is that my boy Water. down? It is my boy down. All right. Are we all, are we all out of fighters again? Yes. I'm gonna put it down at Charlie. I'm gonna put it down at Charlie, George, because Simba's gonna yeah, smack him places. You, can. you... Uh, just establish a corridor. Roger. Diving. Gotta do it before Simba gets here, obviously. You coming down, break. Is your name? Uh, drop. With you. Alright. See, um, I, I don't know who's, who's taking Oompa, but uh, Loompa will be the next priority for Sam. I'm just sticking it down here. Because fight, fighters won't last that long. The, the Sam sites, on the other hand, they're a little bit more robust. Sure. Yeah, that Simba is calling you not robust. I shall prove him differently. Mm, I'm upset. Oh, this thing doesn't slow down! How do you make it slow down, drop? Break something. Well, there. Would yeah. you like me to help you slow down, Cat? Oh, I don't want any help from you. Someone just buzzed me. Oh, sweet. Drops just a bit. Well, I found out how to slow down. It appears you haven't. Put your drops, flaps down, drop. <laughs> drop your drops, drop. Drop your drawers. Right, I've got a perfect place for a NASAMS right here. Viewers. Something, something about landing gear. Right, hydraulic pump. Check. For you as you're about to see the tactical use of the C-130J. Or me crash. Oh no, Simba! You twat! How did he get his equipment? He missed anyway. Can someone please Squirrel come and shoot Fox Simba? Thank you, Simba. Uh, Squirrel. Uh, someone! 
I shot something at someone. I've never been so threatened in my life. Don't no. roll. Please don't roll. No. Jesus Christ, I'm fine. Uh, how do I get this thing down? I don't think it will work. Huh? It will work. If I say it. No, my unit. My beautiful unit. Simba, ich hasse dich. Oh, you're dead as well. Drop. It would appear. Me, no. Oh, yes. God damn it. Where are my fighters? All right, I'm going to switch out of the C5 into a Hercules until we can get this corridor established. And then Roger, I'll George. The C5 in. It's turned into a freaking harder mission than I thought it was ever going to be. George had six minutes. He's obviously never, never met G.O. George, George, George. A few George, hours later. George on his own well, can do six the, minutes. The, the real us. issue here is that they know the exact plan. Uh, most of the time, people don't start shooting it. At, they don't prioritize the, um, the cargo planes. Well, let's hear that, Simba. Stop shooting at us. Yeah, well, I heard of Simba's bitch. I have been using Data Link. I heard Simba's a bitch. Yeah, if only you tracked your missile the whole way to the AWACS. No. no. We do have um, Raptors. We should be having a massive advantage. All right. <laughs> um, That's true. All right, it's this time. No. You know what they say, viewers? No. Three, third time lucky. No. Luck comes in three. I don't know. Something like that. Drop knows all about it. Third time's a charm. There it is. There it is. Got my guy, the guy's going sideways. Drop you find it closer to me. Uh, I keep oh. getting people disappear and then reappear. Yeah, yeah they're like, in, the, in the hills. You're in there, yeah, it's because it's set to date link. Uh, I'm merged with somebody. Right, I suggest shooting him down. No, I absolutely request you shoot him down, actually. Uh, attempting to comply. Your hefty wage packet depends on it, squirrel. Yeah, I said it. Hefty wage packet. Squirrel did the thing. Yeah, overcooked it. Overcooking does happen, guys. Overcooked that cannonball. Really? Yeah, suck it. Now do Simba, and then I'll corridor what is friggin' done. You hear that, Simba? Your goose is friggin' cooked. Amram ER on your lovely Simba face. Shot. Right, now maintain that area. Don't charge in, bird. Be sensible, maintain the area, because I've got to get my C-130s. I lack discipline. You do whack a discipline, don't you, bird? I'm going to get these things down. It's the last friggin' thing I do, Viewington Wilmingtons. Right, the little goose tells me there's some knobbers taking off. Ready, Simba? Really? That's going to work? You. There are no rules in war, Cat. Everything's a runway. Yeah, that's right. what they say at the, tri at the Nuremberg trials. Um, right, Bird? Do a thing. Uh, that's assuming that you win this one, George. Well, I'm nearly at Charlie. I'm going to put them down at Charlie, George, because... As we've established, Simba's being a little bitch. But he is on data link, and he's a little ways out. Shot. Oh, damn it, Bert. What do I actually pay you for? Good. Squirrel's coming in. That Amram hits me, I swear. I swear I think I'm going to scream. It's not going to hit me. If you landed at Icarus? Or, I'm no. sorry, at, at, at Oompa? I'm landing at Charlie, I think. I'm landing oh, at this one true. here. Because the boys are right ahead of me. Yeah. Oof! Shot. Bird. I think that was, um... Yeah, that wasn't Bird. My oh. sidewinder just that scraped was Simba. his Wimba. backside. No, Bird! Right, we've got to put this thing down. Right down to the ground. Cap, deploying. You know me, I love deploying. Like a peacock. Yes, yeah, squirrels all over Simba's face. Ladies and gentlemen, whatever the hell is happening here? Oh my god, the dogfight's right in front of me. Right. Viewers? You ain't never seen no... If I've just died, I'm... Really? You did. What was that? That was Simba. Fuck's sake, Simba! Drops deployed. 
We've deployed SAMS! I'm taking credit for it, but we've deployed SAMS. Well done. Right. Do it again. Yes, and they're working! Simba! How does it feel? He's about to get smacked. <laughs> he ran into our new SAM site. Ah, the tactical benefit of whatever the hell we're doing here. Uh, this is our SAM corridor. It's our friggin' SAM corridor now, Simba. I get the chuff out of our SAM corridor. Man, I've never had my own SAM corridor before, viewers, but I kind of feel like a little That's girl good. in a pet store right now. God damn it, Simba, just die. Hi, Squirrel. Ah, uh, traded with him. Right, you know what? We're making progress, guys. It's painful, it's slow, a bit like my lovemaking, but let's go. What was that word that uh, George described to me with? Lovemaking. No, sexy. No, obtuse. Yeah, th that sounds about right. No. Tenacious. Annoying. Pain in the butt. What's George up to? I haven't seen him in a while, since. George, you might want to just put that sucker right down. We're, we're thinking the same thing. By the way, he also loaded the fuel as if we were taking off from a carrier. I'm striking you right it's off like my Christmas list, bud. It's like I'm flying with this, three bags. You get what you're given, Simba. You know the rules. Never said I couldn't complain. No, I didn't. Right. Hurry up, George. There he goes. Well, I, w I wasn't sure if I was going to take off again. Oh, guys. If uh, Simba gets knocked out, I, I can I can deploy well further down. Oh, right, I see. Uh, oh, yeah, look at George using tactics. This really is George's day. This really is George's birthday, isn't it, guys? Right, big dogfight. Big, important dogfight. I want Simba dead. I want him dead now. Oh, ho, ho. Well done. There's your answer. Simba's out. Simba messed with Raptor. Bad idea. Well, BMP3's come out, and that's all that came out, which is pretty shit, George. Right. Um, your, your plane was shit. Right, well, I, I, I watched it unload. It, it unloaded the right equipment, but once it got out to the ground, it changed into a BMP3. Try a different bird. You know what I've learned from this? Hercules need to be faster. Like, a lot that faster. That is uh, exactly why... It's it's nicer to use some of the other aircraft. I have a mod for C-17s as well. The nice thing about nice. C-17s, they go really fast. Yeah. Downside, they don't land in the dirt. Squirrel, stop shooting. Squirrel, that's down. me. He was just testing his gun sight. Bird. Apologies. Sorry, Bird. Right, Bird, it's imperative you kill Simba. I mean, I don't want to put any pressure on you, but the uh, thing I just said. Bird. Yep, yep, yep. Um. Huh. Uh oh. Yes. Uh, did Raptor win that round? Raptor did Don't not fight. win that. You are now expected to shoot that man. He has a deficit right now. You can get him, squirrel. He does have a deficit. Shit, cannibals up now as well. Oh, this is too hard. How do we get pin sight on that, Tom? C. Thank you. Kudos for doing all this without using your gun so far. Guys, oh, Hercules handles that wet sponge. Landing gear. Landing gear. Landing gear. Landing gear. I have noticed that the Hercules are, are just slightly quicker than the A-10s. Landing gear. That makes me feel bad. Did you get him or is that... Oh, oh look! This. I'm dead. Again. It's too hard, guys. My empanage fell off but then reappeared. Ah, uh, some sort got cannibal. After I launched on cap, so it made me happy. Huh. 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 Yep. 
He used his face. Did he actually get you with his face? Nope. No, I dodged uh, a fox to the bot when I ran out of speed. I'm coming in F15. I'm coming, drop. George, you got missiles coming towards you. Do a UE. Well, I shoot him down. Drop. Do something quick. Alright Simba Wimba, it's the classic fight, the one the fans want to see. Some softball. No bronze. That's one of Simba's only fans. Oh, breaks my heart Simba. Right, where's the next one? Where's the freaking next one? Yes, well done drop. You did a thing! And that is why you circuit the pension payments. Drop. Now where's that null head cannonball? Did you die? I must have shot by them. Yeah! Right. Oh, no, I crashed into uh, the new SAM site. Brilliant. Oh. I hate you naughty boy. everything you do. Hang on. Right, we've got the pin, guys. What we need is big, sexy men to drop stuff. We're gonna roll them tanks right over you. Right, here we go, boys. The final push. Three rap, two raptors, and F-15. A bunch of good old boys. Is a missile out on someone? All right. Only nothing but a thing, bird. Oh, send the wind down. Where's cannonball? Bird, do a thing. Ah, the radar in this plane sucks. Yep, it does. Cannonball splash. Right. In comes the C5. Right, don't hold any punches. Shoot them on the frigging ground. Make them suffer. C5 is 10 miles out. Annihilate them with AMRAMs, guys. Got one locked up on the ground. Smashing them. There's one more up there. Shoot him, bird. Yes, C5. You are free to roll in, my friend. And about freaking time. One of them's rolling. Shoot it. How do you know this? We're literally a mile from your base. All reds, I would give up. I would just give up. I would just plain give up. Got him, bird? It's good captain. There's another one behind you. There's another one behind you. How's that C5 going, George? George respond? Yes, George doesn't respond. Onside is not working, Raptor or whatever the hell I mean. Anyone know where it's George is? It's kind of not very careful to lock him up while they want to work. C5 landing, C5 landing. Fucking plane stalling. Simba, you little bastard. Yep. C5's no good. Oh, you twats. Oh, well. I'm going to take that as, as close as we can get, guys. Hydraulic failure. 
Best landing ever, viewers. Look at that. Oh, to meet Willy Wonka. I landed their airport, now I'm going to take it for my Luger. <laughs> oh, that's just dirty, bro. <laughs> that's just dirty. <laughs> Nothing dirty about it. Oh, that was hard, guys. Uh, okay, that's the thing that's as far as we're going to take it, George. It was fun. It was absolutely fun. But, uh, yeah, that's about as achievable as it is with two high skilled. And I use that incredibly loosely, by the way, uh, things. But it was cool, and I, and I like the theory behind it. Comments from my boys. I would just like to say that so you shouldn't have know. traded me away. Uh, I was definitely an asset to the Reds, and I proved that uh, we were not going to be an easy pushover. Couldn't afford you, Simba. Tell that to my Sam site. Oof. That was my first time in Raptor. First time in Raptor. How about that, guys? George, uh, how did it go for you? You, you landed. George just stopped talking. Don't know why. DJ. Did you learn anything today, even though you turned up late? I learned that uh, y'all just be getting crazy stuff going on. I thought to see if I was going to make it that last little time in there, but just not quite. No. Just, just not quite. Needed a little bit more clearance. A few more seconds with those cheeky boys. All right. Well, I think George has had to go or he's gone off anyway, viewers, but we did the best we could. I... I'll go on in. I'm going to watch the last dog fight and then we'll head off. No, it's George's side. Yes, I just want to say to... that it's a lot easier when you see it done by the computer and then when you add the human aspect, it all goes foobar. Humans can be hard. Are you on comms now, George? Yes, 100% not. His microphone's given out. I hope you enjoyed that, viewers. And bye-bye. Drops deploying. All right, apparently uh, Drop has just deployed right there, right next to their base. In fact, within seven miles of their base, and now he's going to try taking off. Ladies and gentlemen, I've got the Having a few problems there, Drop. You might need rockets for that. Yeah, I used those already. Oh, used them. I think you're, 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 I think you're fine. You're nearly at B1. B1 is 40 dollars. Oh, yeah, okay. Keep going. That's right, lose weight, lose weight. You'll Keep going, or you'll upset DJ. Fuse burning, we're getting lighter, we're getting lighter. <laughs> oh, who'd have thought I can't climb a 20 degree incline? That's quite a hill. That's quite a hill, isn't it? Drop by half day, do it. It's fine, That's right, here we go. Use the ramp. It... Dig up, stupid. Oh my god, it, <laughs> <laughs> it took off. Drop it, took off. You really are a son of a gun. Uh oh, you really uh -oh. are a son of a gun. Right, he's off to take the airfield viewers. Um, definitely bye-bye this time. Yeah, catch you later, guys.